state of mind can even think of electing Ramaphosa for the second term. When you argue with ANC people, do not use too much Marxism and Lenin when you are arguing about Ramaphosa. Just ask them one thing. Tell me one thing that he has done right since he became president. I don't need more. Then I will support you on your second term. There is no single thing in the past years since Ramaphosa became president that he has done right. The economy is collapsing. The price of petrol is too high. The price of food is too high. Since he became president, millions and millions of our people have lost jobs after he said he's going to create jobs. The state of health and education in South Africa is no longer in good condition. When he came in, they said to us, Ramaphosa is going to fight corruption and grow the economy. Today, the economy is in a worse situation than before Ramaphosa became a president. Corruption is at its highest level to a point where people are tired of banking money in the banks. They are banking in their own mattresses. There is no any other definition of the highest form of corruption and immoral leadership than the one we have now. That saves money in the mattress. And then when they find out that another tzotzi is stolen from them, they don't go to court to open a case to the police. They organize other tzotzis to go and look for the other tzotzi. Because that's how the gangsters work. Law-abiding citizens of South Africa, when something is stolen,